to our channel. I am Melski and the handsome lad in the video is Bas. And uh, what else? Do I need to say that he's handsome? I, I mean, it's pretty obvious. We normally go adventuring all over the place. And since travel is a little bit out of the question right now, unless it's locally, and boy, we have done some local travels. So one thing that we've been doing a lot lately is going thrifting. If you, just like us, enjoy watching other people thrift and see what they find, please give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe because we have a backlog of these. We have just gotten around to sort of uploading them. So there's way more of these sort of videos coming and not only do we thrift, <laughs> like our thrifting which started with op shops has gone into going to estate sales and deceased estates and we have also sort of switched on our flipping function. So we thrift and we flip and we also are sort of addicted to curbside pickups. It's crazy what you can find. So I hope you enjoyed this video and our little thrifting adventure. As you will notice, uh, we sort of get um, distracted by actually shopping or looking for good finds. We forget. <laughs> we forget, you know, to do the important thing, which is documented. Guys, don't forget to subscribe and enjoy. Let's do this. Hey, Lasky. Yo, yo, Buffalo. We are up shopping. Today we are thrifting. taking y'all on a thrift haul. Thrift that haul. Time. No, we're going thrift shopping today. During thrift this shopping. isolation time where we spent a lot of time at home, we've actually been watching a lot of thrift shopping on the YouTube. And we're like, yes. Um, I'll turn this for you, babe. What now? Like, you're never serious, are you? I can do your outfit for you. <laughs> Yes. What are you doing? Thanks. Yeah. Christmas outfit sort of. Oh, perfect. This one. <laughs> are you going to have a Latin dance competition? You should get this. This is so cool. The car wash. <laughs> it's another day, another thrifting Thrift adventure. Thrift shop. Today we are always thrift shopping. There's nothing different, babe. <laughs> Always thrifting, always looking for a good deal. You always like put your camera out, and here I'm always dodging trees. And we're in Maylands. Today we're exploring Maylands. Maylands. Oh. It's not May, it's June, so. <sighs> this wall has hearts. It's so cute. Freaking love this box. Oh Look my god. It's so cute. And so, what I'm going to do is full of coasters. But I'm going to take the coasters out and put the box next to my bedside table. It That's is lovely. super cute. It and will look perfect in your little... Yay! Perfect for my laptop needs in bed. Awesome. And shit. What's so heavy? Look at this flamingo pattern. That's cool. Is it a flamingo? It's a flamingo. It's too big skirt for me, but I love the pattern. Sea Queenie, and I'm secretly sort of crushing on this. <laughs> it's fugly. It's too pink, but I, it's cute. How much is it? Oh, this one is seventeen dollars. I would. It looks it's, um. It's summer house dress mm -hmm. sort of thing. Is what mm -hmm. I thought. I won't comment. You won't comment. He's I like Mel. You got. Which one? Oh my lord, look at them. Even that one, like, that would go with that dress. Uh, that would go with that dress. With that dress, yes, it's a whole outfit. What on earth is this? I just saw this sleeve and it said, hey Mel. What's up? Okay, so I found a pillowcase of oh my God. Whitney Houston. Right? <laughs> but, but, okay. it's a little bit awkward because on the back, is her, that's how she died. Like, what's like, going on? Is that on? supposed to be funny or not? I don't know. <laughs> what does it become if you turn it the other way? So it's just a colour, but it's a picture of her. Okay, so you gotta go this way. It's a picture of her. Yeah. But then on the back, it's her dead in the bar. That's awkward. What? It's not my nappy bag. <laughs> <laughs> you're shopping for 
are like you're not even a baby daddy. What I know, but like, doesn't go on like a good baby daddy. <laughs> it's a cool bag. Full stop. It doesn't need to be a nappy bag. It can be a going away bag. Like my baby. Yay! I wanted one of these. Do you want me to paint it up for you, or are you want to keep it that color? White would be cute. Yeah. Yeah. You want it white? Yeah. We're walking and talking. We're going through the next stop, which is. Wearing them um, bell bell We're changing which fabrics have, a little bit. Where we have that eggs. Destination number two. See, you can't really see it's camouflage because that's a big pile of stuff that we're getting back well, with us anyway. We're supposed to be decluttering. We had quite a good, good, good haul. Good haul. Good. good haul. A whole, whole, whole. Yeah. And now we're going back, cooking some din dins. Having some wine. Having some wine. Some cheese and salami. I mean, at some stage we need to do a little like a uh, show. Oh, I like to put it away straight away. Yeah, but we will have to do this. So. Oh really? Mm -hmm. Ooh, yeah. We'll just have to do it when we go home then. Because yeah. I'm going to put it away straight away. Okay. Well I then. can't let it hang around. Like. A show and tell. Okay. So one of the most bizarre little finds that we did today because on our way to the op shop, uh, here in Australia, people just like put things out on the verge in front of their house if they're getting rid of stuff. So we saw a big pile of stuff and that's usually how we get our pots. And trust me, we have heaps of pots. But anyway, Andrew found this now you look at this and you think Mel that's an egg plate that's very random yes it is the reason we picked this up is because seriously look at that price tag basically this plate is someone paid $100 $99 for this plate clearly this must be a collector's item or something like that we just wanted to we couldn't let it go like how can we say no to this plate all of a sudden? Let's check uh, just quickly what we got here. This, ladies and gentlemen, is a big haul of things, uh, including a Christmas apron. Plus. Plus. What are you so proud over? Oh yeah, right, yeah. Andrew picked up that little case from the shop. And he... I'm loving this. It's cool. I like it too. It's my nappy bag. Sort of started watching a lot of people do the same and we're like hey if we enjoy watching this maybe someone will enjoy our crazy discoveries in the op shops uh funnily enough this also ties in with one of my new year's resolutions which was um to put a ban on shopping so this consumerism behavior and mentality needed to stop so i basically put a ban on buying anything new the only thing that i allowed myself to buy new in the shops this year would be underwear and a wedding dress. Everything else, <laughs> um, I needed to be um, resourceful and find in the op shops was basically one of my New Year's resolutions. So, um, I've become very good at op shopping this year. In my head and in my mind, I'm thinking that I'm saving things from landfill and people just throw out and get rid of their clothes that still have so much life in them. And it's really nice items that you can find if you just know what you're looking for. And guys, one thing that I personally enjoy is to sort of read in the comments what people see in the videos that they're like, oh, I really like that. So if you see anything uh, of interest that caught your attention, write in the comments and give us some tips on how to do thrifting videos better, because this is a little bit all over the place. I hope you enjoy. Mm -hmm. 